If during your voltage drop test you find that the ground side shows a high resistance or a high voltage drop, one of the first places to go is your ground location on the vehicle. You can look at your wiring schematic manual to determine where the ground is for your particular vehicle. Once you find the location, then you will remove the ground eyelet and clean the surface on the frame. Sometimes the eyelet may be damaged enough that you just need to replace it. Okay, once we've got it clean, the surface good and clean, we need to make sure that we clean our bolt head where it goes. Once we've got it clean, there's also a second ground, which is a static ground that goes to the filler neck tank. We want to clean it off. Once the rust and scale is removed, then reinstall the ground connection and perform your voltage drop test again on the ground side.